Welcome back again on my channel. If you're just seeing my face for the very first time, my name is Ukola and I film about skincare and a bunch of every other stuff. And in today's video, I am going to be talking about this simple hydrating light moisturizer. I think from the video that I mentioned to you guys, the product that I use on my skin, I got three people actually telling me that they saw a different one, which is not hydrating light moisturizer. And the one they saw was the replenishing moisturizer. And, you know, the question was, is it the same thing? Do you think they just changed the hydrating and replenishing? Just questions surrounding that area and that is why i'm here to actually clarify to you guys and to help you be able to choose the simple moisturizer that you should be using on your skin so i use the simple hydrating light moisturizer because i have the combination skin type my t-zone are always oily so i do not think i need more heavy moisturizer but the replenishing one is actually designed for people who have dry skin it has niacinamide in it as well which is actually very very great for people who have dry skin if you have extremely dry skin that is not the perfect product for you i am not even going to lie to you guys because i have people with dry skin who will actually use it but they are able to get a good result by combining the simple replenishing moisturizer with other products which is hydrating face wash snow essence and as well their moisturizer with a very good toner so if you know you have a lot of other products that actually help you hydrate your skin you can use the simple replenishing one and you can still even use the glycolic acid toner a lot of people would think I have dry skin, I cannot use glycolic acid toner. You can actually use it if you have combination of product or if other product that you're going to be applying on your skin can help you hydrate your skin. So this particular one, if you know you have combination oily skin, this is the simple moisturizer that you should be getting. This is the simple hydrating light moisturizer. If you have oily skin, combination skin, kindly go for this. If you have dry skin, extremely dry skin, you can settle for the replenishing one. It is actually the design for your skin it is so heavy compared to this this is more lightweight compared to the other one so the replenishing one is heavy i don't have that one here with me because i basically don't use it it is going to be so heavy on my skin this is the one that i use on my skin and i've noticed that this is very very lightweight i have i have been using this one for the past one year straight up this is the only moisturizer that i've been using for the past one year i think and it has actually been doing a great job i as well paired this particular one with hyaluronic acid and it has been delivering a very good job for me and then again my face wash is not that it doesn't strip off my skin and i have combination skin so this works for me if you have dry skin kindly set to for the replenishing one if you want to use the replenishing one for your dry skin i'm just going to quickly brush up other product that you should be getting with it to get a very good result so if you want to use that replenishing moisturizer get an hydrating face wash for your face you can use a face wash that contains ceramides or you use CeraVe products or you as well use the simple hydrating face wash then you can go in with a toner to be honest with you guys if you know you have dry skin you can still use the glycolic acid toner at night for your skin this routine i'm talking about can actually serve you in the morning and at night but if you want to use the glycolic acid toner on your skin kindly use it at night and you can switch up that toner for rose water in the morning and use your glycolic acid toner at night so after using that you go in with your niacinamide serum the truth is the replenishing one actually contains niacinamide but i do not think that is enough for you as someone who has a dry skin and wants their skin to look plump and glowy i'm going to still advise you to get a niacinamide serum so after applying your niacinamide serum if you have any discoloration or if you have any discolorating serum or you you just have any brightening serum as well that can go in before you now go in with this your moisturizer no you do not have nice normal you can get the snail essence that as well can fill that spot so just to bring back more hydration on your skin and to help with your dry skin then you go with your moisturizer and your spf I am explaining this way because I noticed some people don't know how to, you know, layer product. You layer your product from the thin one to the thick one. So basically, if you're confused, just check the texture of all the products you want to use on your skin. Then place them from the thinnest to the thickest. That is the way you layer product on your skin. So yes, this is affordable as well. I have been buying this one from 2.5 to 3.5. I buy for 2.5 online. I saw at a new supermarket that was open at my side for 4,000 era. Three days ago, yes, three days ago. For 4,000 era, I think I'm going to be buying the next one there because even if I buy online, I still have to pay for delivery. So yes, this can range from 2,500 era to 5,000 era. I've never seen a place that is more than 5K to be honest. So it's very affordable. 
people with dry skin settle with the replenishing one people with combination normal oily skin you can settle with this particular one it actually delivers a good job for me because i compare it to other products like i said earlier if you have used it before please let me know in the comment section and if you have used it before and you stop using it can you let me know why you stop using it as well in the comment section if you fall into that category thank you all so much for joining if you haven't subscribed kindly do me a favor by smashing the subscribe button and turning your bell notification on and i'm going to talk to you guys in the next one bye guys